RT Rehab is a machine used to strengthen the lower limbs in terms of both extensor and flexor muscles. It is made up of a chair that is easy to use even for those that have difficulty moving. It has a reclinable backrest which makes it possible to position the patient correctly. The movable arm can also be adjusted. It can be adjusted in both height and depth so that the rotation axis for the movable arm can be aligned with the axis of rotation for the knee. The main characteristic of RT Rehab is the movable arm made up of three parts. A loading arm, the loading arm is used to position the load to be overcome during the exercise. A selector. The selector is used to select the starting and completion angles for the exercise itself and a thrust arm. Finally, there's the thrust arm to which the patient applies their muscular strength. The selector provides for three settings. The first allows the movable arm to be released, making it possible to adjust the thrust arm to the required angle. The subsequent two settings are activated by means of a two-stage release system, which is used to adjust the starting and completion angle. When these settings have been done, it is possible to once again lock the system at the set, starting and completion angles. To complete the description of this machine, the movable arm can be moved for use on the other limb. The range of movement is adjusted again in order to precisely reproduce the work done with the other leg. Once the patient is sitting on the machine, first of all, the thigh must be secured so that the knee stays still at all times. The rotation axis for the movable arm can then be aligned with axis for the knee by adjusting the height and depth of the movable arm. At this point, having decided on the working angle, the patient can begin the exercise. This is the RT Rehab's classical function, that is, extending the leg determined by contraction of the quadricep, termed concentric contraction. It is also possible to vary the exercise by doing a purely isometric contraction. To do an isometric exercise using RT Rehab, the machine has to be adjusted to position the loading arm parallel to the thrust arm. In this case, the patient does the isometric contraction without mechanical effort, but only by means of physiological work done by the extensor muscles. In order to activate the rear thigh muscles, the loading arm must be counterposed to the thrust arm so that the back of the ankle of the patient's foot rests on the cushion and the flexor muscle of the lower limb is activated. RT Rehab can also be used to do passive extension exercises for the knee. The back of the ankle of the foot is put on the thrust arm cushion and a weight is hung from the loading arm. At this point, the counterposition of the angles creates an upward tension on the thrust arm, which is transmitted to the knee, extending it passively due to the block put on the thigh on the machine's chair. RT Rehab is used for a rehabilitation program set up to regain full functionality of the extensor and flexor muscles in the lower limbs.